Ugh. How? How could a superior half-elf like me? It's because you are a fool, Magnius. Crucius has accepted Colette as the Chosen. What? That's right. Colette is going to regenerate the world. We're not going to lose to someone like you. So... You're... Then... I was deceived. Boyd! Damn it! This should allow the people imprisoned in the ranch to escape. What about the x spheres implanted in them? Without key crests, it's only a matter of time before they go out of control. Can't we just take the x spheres off of them? It's dangerous to attempt to remove an x sphere lacking a key crest. I would imagine only a dwarf could handle it. Then we can ask Dirk to do it. Yeah, let's contact my dad. We can work out the details later. Right now, I'm going to program this place to self-destruct. Ready? Are you serious? Wayne, if you do that... At the very least, we'll deal a major blow to the Desion Stranglehold over this region. If we're going to strike them, it should be thorough and decisive. Rain? Remember, Genus, we're not like them. We're different. I've set the self-destruct timer for ten minutes. Let's hurry and evacuate. I must inform Porcistus while I can! I have a slight problem with you contacting Lord Porcistus. He realized what I'm trying to do. Rodile! You... You deceived me! There was no order to eliminate the Chosen, was there? <laughs> Collecting gold for me? Attempting to eliminate the Chosen for me? You've been quite useful, Magnus. Farewell! I hope you enjoy the afterlife! Damn it! Lord Eutrasiel! Glory to the coming age of Half-Elves!